Kelly. In and out, Kareem, who just came in, gets another rebound. Jabari watching as Cooper to the other end. Block shot and answer. They come, Kelly, on the kickoff. Seven. Well, Dennis Johnson challenge as we take a look at the defensive end, which started to break up with it. Magic Johnson's got it. They come down three on two in the middle of the break. Try to get it to Wilkes. Too far underneath. Deflected by Kelly. Here comes Nance. He's 6'10. Gallops into the forecourt. Goal pending. As Wilkes is trying to come the other way to make the score, and then Larry Nance, who's young enough. Me, Jamal Wilkes. And you see how he overplays, tries to force him to stay on that right hand. Now they try and force him back to the right to the strong side of the defense. Nance on the double screen may see tough to stop. Well, that was a great setup by the Suns, and again, they walked that clock down, so they're controlling the tempo of the game, and the Suns get their second lead. First being 32-31. Magic. Kareem with great position down and deep, but they couldn't get him the ball inside, and the Suns make a good turnover. Walter Davis pitches it away, so they get a turnover. The Lakers get a good break. To try and duplicate what Jeff Houston of Cleveland did last night, but I don't think at this tempo they're going to get that many off. Houston had 27 assists in a Cleveland win last night. Best in the league. This year he's number nine. Down they go. That's Dennis Johnson. DJ. One of 16 children. He misses. Of their basketball plans. He goes down and suddenly you're searching for a, a adequate replacement. They found it so far and they continue to roll. Phoenix has not scored in the last four and a half minutes. And they just do. Four and a half minutes it took them to score that basket as they come back to look at again. Well, this is back at you. You can do it, so can we. And Larry Nance, well above the rim. You look at him right the ball and get it down. Again, what makes that play possible, no pressure on the passer. They've turned the ball over seven times in the fourth period. They have lost the edge as far as their slowdown game and the turnovers created by the Lakers. And, well, I don't know why. With the slowdown game, they could certainly afford to use Cook. He's not a very quick man, but he has not played at all. On the outlet, here comes Macy to Nance. Just a little something for you fans that think that we don't have anything left as far as it. And we'll look at Nance get his moment in the sun. I guess you call this French pastry. We'll see what he learned at the Cook School. Squeeze it, Larry Nance. And out of so much fun to watch, Michigan State played on the NC2A championship team. Hurt the knee last year. Games behind the division leading Lakers. Seattle breathing heavily, however, they trail by a game. But idle tonight, the Lakers will pick up a half game. There's Larry Nance, he's got 16 points. Work it down now. There's Magic. Two seconds. What a pass. And coming up shy, Jamal Wilkes. Nance, outlet Alvin Adams. Shoot it back to Nance. Big jam. 95, 85. Dennis Johnson from the Suns. 97, 85. Six seconds remaining. And falling out of bounds with that one was. Kyle Macy, Nance again. He disjoints himself when he dunks it. And he may have to go in and get his back cracked on that one.